Hi, this is Matthew Weatherby, aka Vegan of Power. You can see I'm at my beautiful park here. So this is where I like to do kung fu and sprints. Did sprints just recently. Definitely lost some wind over the last two weeks while I was sick and not doing them. Taking me longer to recover than normal. So today I want to talk about silliness. So I was reading this article where this vegan was trying to help high performance athletes who wanted to make the switch from whatever kind of diet they were doing, say paleo or just standard omnivore or whatever they may be doing, to veganism. And he was clearly laying out some of the problems that people making the switch have had in the past. And offering helpful solutions and it was a very very good website I really enjoyed it then I'm reading in the comments below and some vegan comes on and starts screaming about how there are no problems in a vegan diet it's the perfect diet made by nature like everything about veganism is perfect and yada 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 and I'm like dude in case you didn't notice this guy's on the same side as you he's supporting the same cause as you and he's doing it in a way that makes sense. He's helping people. Now, you can't tell me that someone can switch to veganism in full 100% ignorance, not knowing what they're doing, and accidentally neglect their B12 and have some serious nerve and brain damage or some serious blood issues or all kinds of things that B12 contributes to. So that's total nonsense and ignorance on this person's part. The person making the site was actually improving the world around him. He was actually helping the cause. He was actually helping people that would like to make a difference and change the way they're interacting with the world at this time. And this person was taken away from the cause. People see that kind of nonsense and they think, man, these vegans are out of control. So save your energy, save your arguments for people who are actually saying stupid things that are hurting the world, not for people that are actually trying to help the world and help other people. That's really all I want to talk about in this video is just don't have a stupid, stupid mindset where you just dogmatically accept something and think that your opinion's correct just because you believe it. Try looking around at the world the way it really is and adapting accordingly. That's what this person making this website was doing. He was seeing real life problems people have who actually did want to make a difference but cared about their performance because they were a high performance athlete and he offered real life feasible solutions that actually work in the real world instead of in imagination land. And this loser comes on and starts criticizing it grow really really weary of stuff like this you know if you don't know what you're talking about just be quiet and I'm not saying you just have to be quiet all the time because you don't know anything but don't don't spout your ignorance in places where people who actually have knowledge are speaking and are actually making a difference now if this person actually was contradicting your cause was actually hurting your cause then I could see why maybe you'd be inspired to speak out. But he wasn't, he was helping it. Use your head, don't be an idiot. That's all I have to say today.